It was an ungraceful day. Um, our youth group and I were heading for a seminar. We decided to board a bus which could accommodate all of us. The bus had a breakdown. The driver told us that there was a nearby stage just a few meters ahead. On reaching the stage, we were shocked. Alas, the place was congested. Our patron, who was pregnant, was pushed. My best friend lost sight of my younger sister, all tension. My other friend could not be accommodated by the matter. Guess why? He was crippled. This really touched my heart, and that is when I decided to call some of my friends and we sat down and came up with an app and came up with an app. I am Sharon Nyanchoka, director of Transap, and this is Powertech. Over the years, short distance transport has not been keenly taken care of compared to long distance. My friends and I sat down and thought of a way to ensure safe and efficient transport of people and goods with the aid of technology. Boom! The idea of Transap came about. My name is Brooke Achola, coordinator of Powertech Technovation Group. Unlike other apps, e.g. Safe Border, which only specialize in one sort of transport, TransApp caters for all sorts of transport, be it a matatu, tuk-tuk, any of your choice, but shh, over short distances. Research has proven that the transport sector has improved 8.8% .8 in 2020 compared to 2019. Hence, the strategy of our program is to expand, modernize, and maintain road transport network and ensure safe and sufficient transportation of people over short distances. I am Megan Tess, the developer of Transap. Our app is designed to curb situations such as congestion, corning, discrimination, and accidents. How? The customer has to fill in details about where he or she is, where he or she is going, the number of seats, and the way of payment. Way of payment is through M-Pesa, swiping the visa, and Equitel, and many more as per your preference. This is to reduce the risk of contracting the virus during pandemics like this. Our special needs, you are not left behind. How? You have to fill in the same details, but instead the vehicle has to come to where, to where you are as per your preference. So this is affordable, safe and efficient for you. For overloading purposes, the customer has to fill details about the luggage. You will receive a ticket and all you have to do is ride smoothly to your preferred stage, get your luggage and be on your way. For more information and inquiries, there is an information button where you can learn more about Transap in just one click of a button. My name is Mkanya Boke. I'm the marketing director. In our app, we're going to specialize on transport circles and public ownerships. Now, how are we going to advertise our app? We are going to place our app in social media apps like Facebook, Twitter, YouTube and Instagram. And we're going to use printouts like magazines and stickers. Also, we are going to advertise our app in TVs and radios. This is because many people like listening to them. My name is Valerie Andeso. I'm the financial advisor of the Transap. We as the Transap, our stakeholders are transport circles such as Maniboro in Kisi County and Kimau in Nairobi County. We anticipate to have a total of 1 million shillings by the end of the first year, which will help in marketing sectors for advertisement and made known to people about our app. In the second year, we anticipate to have a total of 2 million, which will help in making our own circles, where we'll use to invest in more motorbikes and border borders to improve on our living standards from people from low living standards. And we are... Power Tech.